now I'm going to talk a li- little bit about next next week because uh, Cafe 55 will be open uh, until half past two. And I think Chris Norton from The World Show is going to be there from about 12, perhaps. And we'll still be doing the show here. Um, but it might be a chance to, to experiment with how you can mix up being in a cafe and being in a radio studio. Uh, we'll, we'll just see what, what can be done. Um, I think if, if they do stay up till 2.30, that's plenty of time. And we'll do a, do a sort of mix of reality and drama. The, the drama show is tomorrow, uh, between 8 and 10. And it just sort of crosses over. I think what happens is I get, well, for me anyway, I get, I get into reality and it all becomes a bit much and I start imagining alternatives. And that might take the form of a play or fiction of some kind. And then eventually I'll go back to reality in some other other sort of way. So we've been we've been talking with, with JD. JD's very very he's very practical about this. He doesn't see it as a, as fiction. I don't think um, he would like some sort of studio. That's to say, some sort of equipment somewhere a bit more accessible than this basement or a normal radio studio where the equipment is all sort of protected and the soundproofed spaces and it's all very well it's very, it's very good thing in some some ways but it's not like a cafe so um he would he would like lightweight equipment such as appeared during the lockdown um to be adapted to be just a bit more reliable and to turn up in spaces like cafes so i've um, come up with fiction uh, well a sort of fiction like like spaces that can be taken over em- empty shops that become art galleries um, or even get funding to be art spaces um, so far haven't been much to do with sound sound isn't within the art scope well enough I don't think I, I might be wrong about that if there's any artists out there listening who who uh, have experience with that or ways of presenting uh, sound as something that, that um, would be an attraction in a city centre uh, that would be that would be interesting to know know how that works um, but meanwhile we'd, we've been thinking about Debenhams because De- Debenhams is sort of empty in Exeter but apparently there's lots of plans for it so um, JD's researched the reality and I, d- I don't know how it'll be, but we we thought about um, just moving it moving it to being a play about a discussion. So it'll be a committee meeting, which I'll be trying to present as if it's a fiction, but it may be reality as well somehow. So that'll be next week on Wednesday, um, either on the We Don't Know show, 10 to 12 on Phonic FM, or soon afterwards... Uh, till about two two o'clock two th- fifteen two thirty two thirty I think there's planning to shut uh, cafe fifty five which is um just off queen street uh near the near the hotel there um, so if you've got if you've got bits of m p three or scripts or anything like that that would fit that idea so um uh, how 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 a radio a, temp, a temporary radio studio is the overall uh, headline title for it all and uh, now I'm going to play a, a, a track by Dusty Springfield and a track by Joss Stone I, I didn't mention when talking about um, Debenhams or Debex it's got a hashtag Debex pro, pro, project to um, work out what to do with space in the middle of cities and um include radio or sound recording of some kind uh, sort of mix which we'll talk about either as fiction or poss- possibly as fact a little bit of bit of fact in there um, I, 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 don't, I, I think that I think a few copies have come back again but um, never forget my love Just Stone CD definitely went out of stock in uh, HMV I, I think the CD's don't know what's uh, happening with it. John would tell me it's gone anyway. I think, um, 
but the the the, the, the so the idea of Debenham sort of came out of that trying to work out how the the fashion um, aspect would work because uh, most of of uh, HMV is now t-shirts and garments of different kinds. Um, when when she was talking about the the uh, the new CD, Joss Stone spoke about the look of of which you can tell from the the videos a bit. Uh, it is based on uh, Dusty Springfield show, which is on 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 the iPlayer at the moment, and um, Dion Warwick style sixties seventies. So I'm just going to try out uh, putting putting songs in the same sort of sequence and see 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 how it, see how it works from that. And um, then the, the thing think about though, clothing has just gone got a lot more casual. So I don't know how much of that would really work in a department store or whatever that sort of s slot would be. But uh, anyway, I'm going to try out some of the some of the songs and see see um, see where we go with it. <laughs> 